Hello everybody and welcome back to On The Go With EF. I'm in Sydney, Australia, and today I'm going to see some of the special animals of Australia here at the Wildlife Park. So now we're inside the Wildlife Park, and right off the bat I can see some really cool birds over here. The big birds over there are very iconic here in Australia. It's the laughing kookaburra. Kookaburra is actually an Aboriginal word, which means laughing bird. And it's because of this sound that they make, which sounds like they're laughing. They're actually way bigger in person than I thought. Also, let's see what other birds do we have here. Crimson rosella. That's that colorful one there with the red and blue. Beautiful, beautiful birds. One of these birds was outside my window this morning making noise, so I couldn't sleep. But at least they're pretty. So these animals we've got here are called red-necked padamelons. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. I thought they were wallabies at first, but I don't know. They seem to be in the same species, I would or the same kind of animal, the same family, I would assume. It's such a fun way to move around, just bouncing like that. These little creatures get to move freely around here. One has just escaped. <laughs> Seems to be popular among the tourists. To sleep. This must be a wombat. These are closely related to koala bears. A tour guide told me that they spend most of their lives sleeping, much like the koala bears as well. Seems like a relaxed lifestyle. Whoa, those are massive Australian pelicans. <laughs> this also reminds me of those birds in uh, Finding Nemo. They're huge, that beak, and the beak is quite like, you know, loose. I guess it's so they can easily fish up or kind of swoop down and get the fish in their mouth. Kangaroos are the only large animals that use hopping as a way to move. As you can see here, they've got big powerful hind legs, a big tail for balance, and then a small head. They can reach speeds to up to 70 kilometers an hour. It's really fast considering that they just jump like that. Kangaroos are marsupials, which means they carry their young in a pouch. This guy was very hungry. Well, I found a little baby kangaroo over there. The babies are known as joeys. Okay, it's already eating from the ground, but I'll try to see if it wants to eat from my hand. That was really cool. I managed to convince the Joey to eat from my hand. This one looks very relaxed. Just laying on the side. <laughs> Guys, one interesting day I've had. Australia has so many unique animals and I'm really happy I got to hand feed a cute little kangaroo. What's the cutest animal you know? Leave a comment below and the best answer can win this mug with Aboriginal artwork on it. 
All right, guys, make sure you watch next week's episode when Angelina shows you Coronado Island in San Diego. See you next time. Bye-bye.